Our second example here is a hiker shouts towards a cliff that is 450 meters away. If the echo is heard 2.75 seconds later, what is the speed of the sound wave? If the wavelength is 0 0.750 meters, what is the frequency? So let's write down what we know. And we know to find our velocity, we're going to have to do distance over time. But before I write anything down, let's think about we're doing an echo. So it has to travel this 450 meters to the cliff and 450 meters back. So our distance is 900 meters. And make sure you use the appropriate adding rules in order to get your significant figures here. And our time is 2.7 seconds. And we're going to need the wavelength in a little bit. 0.750 meters. So to find our velocity, we do velocity equals distance divided by time. So velocity equals 900 meters, 2.75 seconds. Our velocity is 327 meters per second. And we can look at our numbers. We can see this has four sig figs, this has three, so our answer will have three. In order to find the frequency, we have to use our other equation, velocity, wavelength times frequency, so 327 equals 0 0.750 meters times frequency. We're going to divide both sides by the 0 0.750, and the meters cancel out, giving us per second, which we call hertz. And with three significant figures, we have 436 hertz. Now I would count it right if you said 436 per seconds or if you said hertz because that's two, just two different ways of saying the exact same thing.